I was just always that kid that just did whatever. And my mom always supported that. So I always looked up to Michael because he was never afraid to just be himself. Never tried to be anything that he wasn't. Justin Bieber. Is there a better reflection of a culture than its pop stars? Like Nubal little Tesla coils, our chart toppers are very often both receptors for and projections of our collective energies. And, at 21, Justin Bieber, the kid who grew up playing for cash on the streets of small town Canada and now plays to sold out arenas across the world, is basically living like our collective ID if our collective ID were jet skiing on an ocean of money and fame, stepping out with models, befriending moguls, modeling underwear and hooping it up at the Staples Center with Kanye West. Bieber's Instagrams are perfect little portraits of adolescent appetite paired with the kind of material wealth to accommodate it, whirling around on a Back to the Future style hoverboard, as he was in a recent video, while aboard a private jet. But it's not as if Bieber isn't totally unaware of what goes on down here in the mundane world. In March, he threw a Friars Club style roast of himself on Comedy Central, inviting the likes of Martha Stewart, Kevin Hart, and Snoop Dogg to poke some holes in the very self-serious, straight-faced image he'd been projecting. Look, he gets it. He knows what it looks like to be arrested for racing a skittle-colored Lamborghini down the streets of Miami Beach. But he's ready to laugh at himself too. Bieber has, since the age of 15, been a massive, global star. His debut EP, My World, released in 2009, and the album My World 2.0, released the next year, both went platinum in under two months. The 3D film experience Never Say Never, 2011, is to believers what A Hard Day's Night, 1964, was to Beatlemaniacs, if A Hard Day's Night were shot in IMAX, at Madison Square Garden. In other words, he has been drowned in love and affection and their scary offshoot, obsession for about as long as Obama has been in the White House. So, even as he begins to actualize as a real adult human, as he begins to individuate from his mother and his manager, Scooter Braun, Bieber probably has to break away from us, too. He's coming out from beneath those beautiful bangs and super-produced hooks to become something more like himself, Bieber unplugged. Because, good, bad, worshipped, and cut down to size, Bieber up to this point has been a part of us. But now, as he readies to release his new album, he is remaking himself on his own terms.